what an evening. I feel like uh, the guy who's going to sweep up afterwards. It's like, oh, yeah, then there's that guy. Who's that guy again? I'm going to walk down the red carpet, and they're going to go like, and yes, let me talk to him. I don't think so. John Berlin, my brother in flesh. And here we go. Steve Berlin of uh, Los Lobos and One Upon a, uh, upon a Time eaters. of X. Yes. And, and Flesh Eaters, the indeed. Flesh Eaters. Um, God, 30 years ago, who would have thought you'd be standing here for Bob Dylan on an we evening like this? We both yeah. thought. We both hoped. We actually thought. spoke about it once, remember? Yes, I remember that time. We were so high, we thought, <laughs> yeah. we're going <laughs> to... One day. What did we get at the uh, LA Convention Center? Yeah. Talk about the song. I hear Bob pick the songs for you guys. Is yeah, as, as far as I heard, uh, it was people who did covers that he liked of his songs. Uh -huh. And uh, I did this Pressing On song for I'm Not There, the movie that Todd Haynes did. And, and it was uh, Joe Henry. I got to give Joe Henry a lot of credit because uh -huh. I think he was in my corner pitching, you know, get John to sing for uh, Christian Bale. And, and so I did, and, and he liked it. And uh -huh. it was like, right on. Fantastic. By the way, you just missed Bruce Springsteen. He just walked past you. <laughs> You know, you could have, you're here can't you have every. Yeah. I've got John Doe and Steve yeah, Berlin. What, 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 what? <laughs> you're bullshitting with me. You know, oh, no, no. Oh, who the boss? The boss who? <laughs> Steve, talk about the song that you guys are doing. Uh, strangely enough, I didn't know that yours was. Uh, I'm not there. Ours was as well. Um, it was. You know, they reached out to us to uh, to do the track, and um, we were uh, we were on the road, and it was. It, we were in Minneapolis, and we're like, Shit, how are we gonna pull this off? You know, it's like we had like an afternoon to do it. And I found a friend of mine had this little studio that was about to be torn down. So it was like the last hours of the studio before the wrecking ball hit. And there was like a marimba sitting in the corner. So Dave, when there's a marimba part on it, which we won't do tonight. But I uh, just, uh, yeah, it was, it was just kind of an honor to be, you know, even then was an honor. And then to be asked to be part of this thing, it's just like, geez, it's amazing. So, yeah, we're just so happy to be here, hang out with friends. I mean, you know, you've got Bruce, goes to Sills now. I mean, some... We all grew up about the same time, some genuine heavyweights. Of the, you know, it must be, uh, blow your minds a little bit to be out here with, with, in such company. And, you know. Well, sure. I mean, without it having false humility, uh, yeah, they, they, they won Grammys and shit. You know, we, I, you know, we all have some credibility and stuff for hanging in and writing songs and Bob Dylan giving us a little tip of the cap. But, I mean, it's Neil Young. So I have no illusions as to <laughs> who's top dog here, you know. Uh, I'm, I'm glad that uh, Nora Jones is here and Susan Tedeschi and, and Bonnie Wright, you know. Right, right. Uh, right. My dream would have been uh, PJ Harvey, because she did a kick-ass version of Highway 61, but I'm not gonna like say, Bob, you picked the wrong guy, so. <laughs>